Hey, hey, they gave you a broom? A super advanced alien, they give you a broom. Um... You have an ID badge too? The what the fuck? Silo. The secondary silo can be reached through. What's me. your name? No, no, no. I was looking at that name of yours. Yuriha? Yurihar? Something like that. It's weird ass names you guys have. And our best friend is back. <laughs> Wasn't that long ago that we seen you, was it? Can't read Russian. Hey, an extra pair of hands. Right through here. Magnuson must have sent you. Okay, apparently I can't shoot. Apparently I can't shoot that guy. Ow, what the fuck? That didn't work. That's gonna do with assholes. Ow. Hello. Anybody here? Oh god, man hacks. Not something I'm looking forward to. Ooh. Yeah, you know what else kills hunters? Fucking shotguns. Come on, man. Got time for that. Just need the help. It's back here. Ooh, goodies. There's always plenty of health in this game. It's one thing I like about this game, is it'll starve you for help. Doesn't make you feel like you can't do anything because there's not enough health. There's always plenty of health and most of the time plenty of ammo. What the fuck? Bitch, I shot you. I threw a grenade down there, I'm pretty sure.
Well then, we won't go with that. Actually, let's go ahead and... Chit 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 I just want to keep this ammo because I may need it while uh, fighting those hunter things. Oh, that's great. Not get hit by those bullets. Okay, just fucking take care of the problem for me. That's always, uh. Well, that's always beneficial. Ow, you fucking cunt hole. Oh, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Fuck you, fuck you. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. God, fuck you. I hate hunters so much. Okay. Safety, maybe? No fighting for two minutes? Maybe. Maybe I am just so lucky. Oop. God damn, why is it fucking blowing my fucking screen up? That didn't sound good. Did not like the sound that was made with that. Before I jump down there. Thank you. Boop. Alright. Any more stuff in there? No. It's a book. Oh, those things. Looks like we're going swimming. I have known this. For you guys to not have closed those doors. You know, I don't know why there's not access to these doors any other. Ow, ow what the fuck? Oh, this guy here. Sounds like a rocket going off, man. Well, this is just not safe. Some goodies there. Goodies I just think I can't pass up. Man, fuck you guys. You playing with that shit. I know, I'm making my way to the room to do it. Can you, like, give me two minutes? Two minutes is all I need, man. Ow.
bitch. Fuck you! Ha! <laughs> Why the hell would you guys not? I guess I had this thing here. I could have just been like, boom, but I wasn't like that. Gordon, nice of you guys to show up. Thank I want God that thing. Okay. Glad that's over. Yeah, me too. That's we couldn't get in. Pain in the ass. Off the silo when the blast doors opened up. Regrettably true. I better let my dad know you're all right. Yeah, you probably should do that. That'd probably be beneficial for everybody. You know, why don't we have radios? Yes, Alex. Is everything okay? Is Gordon all right? Yes, he's fine. And thanks to him, the base is secure. Good, good. We're about to transmission. We'll head right over. Hmm. Oh, I can get up here. Wow. Where are we going? The freeman must follow. I'm waiting on you guys. Don't run. Is that important? If you would take the freeman from here, I can return to my place of honor at the side of the darkness. Sure thing. Thanks for the help. Dr. Kleiner told me that Judith headed north in a helicopter right after they got here. But he wouldn't tell me why. Okay. So is this where Dr. Kleiner... No, wait. Dr. Mossman, is this where like, she teleported everybody to? I'm fairly sure I shoot down the location of the project. It's hard to say how much of it might have survived intact, or whether there's anything remaining that could compromise our work, if it were discovered by the Combine. We'll need to take a close look at it, of course, but I should be able to give a better opinion within a few hours. If the site is where we think it is, then it should be no more than... I'm gonna cut this short. We may have been spotted. May have been? Never have let her go. There was no stopping her, Eli. Wait a moment. There's something else here. It's the Borealis. Good God. Incredible. What? The Borealis? It's real? Oh yes, quite real, despite its almost legendary stature. Our peers at Aperture Science were at work on a project of some promise. But in their rush to beat Black Mesa for funding, they must have compromised ordinary standards of risk. We heard their research vessel had simply disappeared, vanished with all hands, and even part of the dry dock. Few believed the Borealis would ever be seen again. It should have been lost forever. Ah, but now that we've found it, we can use it against the Combine. Did you- Use it? That thing has to be destroyed. But think of the advantage for humanity. We can't simply waste all that potential. Has Black Mesa taught you anything? There's no controlling that kind of power. Well, yes. There's always a risk, Eli. But my goodness, we have coordinates, blueprints, hailing frequencies. Quite ingenious of Dr. Mossman to hide it all in the carrier way. Well, that means she's still alive up there. But if the Combine catches her. It'll tear out everything she knows. There'll be nothing left of her. But we don't know for sure I won't that take that chance. I'm going after Dad. her. Now, Eli, the only thing worse than Judith falling into their hands would be if they should get a hold of you. She may know the particulars of the Borealis, but you, you know everything about the Resistance. Listen to Dr. Kleiner, Dad. Gordon and I are more than able to handle this. We'll get her back. Kleiner, where are you? Why isn't the coding a... finished? Oh, fine. That is. It's one of those yes, old telephone is... things. It just needs a little bit longer. You're waiting for the combines. Go ahead. Like a rotary so dial. I don't really know what it's called, though. First. But I'll hurry it along, Magnuson. I'll be back as soon as I. Can. Oh shit! Dad, are you okay? Look at that thing.
Look what I found. Dad. Prepare for unforeseen consequences. What did you say? Oh, what the hell? Okay. It's okay. Just, just lean into me. No, not what I wanted. Thank you, baby. I'll be fine. In a minute or two. Okay. Do you need anything? Actually, Alex, would you... Would you mind getting me a cup of tea? There's a hot plate in the old staff room. I'll be right back. Do you mind getting me one, too? Gordon, you keep an eye on him? Pow! Boom! Consequences. <laughs> the last time I heard those words was back at Black Mesa. You had just stepped into the test chamber when he whispered them in my ear. You know who I'm talking about. Our mutual friend. When he brought in that crystal, I knew I... I should have aborted that damn test, but I didn't. The whole world went to hell that day. And now, now he's using my little girl, putting words in her mouth. God damn it. I should have known when he rescued her, it was for his own damn reasons. Gordon, there's so much I need to tell you. Well, then tell me, Big Between Papa. Us, we may finally have a chance. Of, um, Here you go. Bitch, you need to leave. There's nothing, honey. All right, people, change of plans. There is no way we can launch before those striders are. Oh, what? Oh, excuse me if I'm interrupting tea time. <laughs> You're I'll such an asshole. Until you finish, if that's yep. More that hurt your nose. Well, Freeman, I believe I've found the perfect use for you. Follow me. Quick. No, I'm not going nowhere. Uh, we'll talk later. I'll, I'll catch up with you in a bit. You know, we need to talk now, you old decrepit man. You're gonna die soon. Guess we're going through this door. Freeman, striders are coming. No shit. A single one of those damn things could shoot down our rocket. What's that thing? Don't dare launch until all striders are destroyed. Now you've proved yourself capable, and the staff seem to respect you. Therefore, I'm putting defense of white forest. So one, grab one of those. Two, shoot it at the strider. Three, shoot that and it kills the strider. We call it the Magnuson device. Not my chosen label, you understand, but it seemed to please the personnel. Now look lively in there. Warm up the delivery port. Whatever you say. Now what it is, is a sort of sticky bomb. Although cleverer than that makes it sound. From your point of view, you merely pitch the device at the strider's hull. Then blow it up. I've struggled with a mechanism for launching the device, but well, your zero point energy field manipulator clears up that little problem. Really? Now follow me and we'll let you get in some practice while we still have time. Oh. Fancy fancy. Don't be alarmed, Freeman. This strider's days of impaling your friends are a thing of the past. Now, out in the field. We'll supply you with all the Magnuson devices you need through delivery ports like this one. Okay. For the safety of the base, these devices are deactivated. They cannot explode like those you will find in the room. That's right. Now toss it to the main body. Good. Now. There you go. Ah, not too difficult at this range, is it? Gets a bit harder when it's moving about and firing at you, of course. Now, let's move on to a more challenging task. Uriah, send the target to the far Uriah. end Uriah, that's how you say his name. Very well, Try it now. Okay. Magnificent device, isn't it? I'll be right over here when you are ready to head up. So it kills him on one hit? Had enough? 
sure. The car is fueled and ready to go. Now, every building in the valley has its own dispenser port, so you'll have ample supply of explosives. Now, I must get back to my rocket, Freeman. I'm relying on you not to squander my trust or my magnetons. Oh, my friend, but I was supposed to squander magnetons. Come on with me, friend. You know the one I mean, involving a certain microwave casserole. Listen, don't leave your shit in the lounge like that, then. Come with me. He left his shit in the lounge, so you know what? Hey, Dr. Freeman, over here. No, I need a few liberties with your car. Check it out. I added a rack for Magnuson devices back here. Put it in the front seat, too. I tweaked your onboard radar so the combines show up red on the dashboard unit now. Plus, it'll send a homing signal to your HEV suit in case you get separated from your car. Oh, well, that's nice no of you. Me. Why can't you have done that now fucking years ago? What? I'm oh, sorry. Right here at the south end of the valley. Rest of the gang's up north by the old sawmill here. Head yep. on up there, and they'll fill you in on the battle plan. Okie dokie. Staying here to watch the field and send status updates. All right. Good luck out there. Yep. We got bombs on board, man. Oh, well, had bombs. Oh, that side opens up. This is gonna be a bitch. Perimeter's clear. Still no sign of incursion. Keep alert. Come closer. Doctor Frank. Yep. So they've sent Freeman, have they? Good man. We've counted a dozen striders just north of us. Our job is to keep them from reaching the base to the south. A dozen? There's only twelve? close enough for one good shot at the silo, the whole launch is a bust. And in case striders aren't bad enough, recon indicates they're being escorted by packs of hunters. Now, what I want you to do... Attention! Uh oh North perimeter breach. All right, people, this is it. We have a strider approaching from the cranes. Defensive position, go! Remember, keep them distracted while Freeman takes them down. Oh man, this is gonna be bad. What the fuck? Oh, this is gonna be a juggling act. Fucking. This is a juggling act of fucking shit. Okay, that fucked me up. Turn no help playing around, cause I'm not gonna last much longer now. I'm really not, guys. Like, okay, so fuck, who was a fucking log? Oh, you gotta be shitting me right now. I'm gonna die. Guys, I need help. Like, if we didn't stock this shit with help, we're fucking retarded. Thank God. Get the fuck out of the way. 
Hello. Fuck. Fuck, what the fuck did it blow up for? That's some shenanigans. Man, fuck that goddamn thing, man. Fuck you. Suck at this kind of mission. First of all, I can't fucking walk full speed, man. Don't shoot me, don't shoot me, don't shoot me, don't shoot me, don't shoot me! Fuck you. 